And on our way to that lion, we found you this, a woolly necked stork. And in this particular vantage point, we get to see two things which are quite uncommon. And the bronzy iridescence on the wing, on the middle of the wing. And there you can just see it now with the sun behind us. Just sticking out is a rare thing to see on this woolly necked stork. As well as the feces that it covers its legs with. And there you can see that it's been a hot day. And that is dung on its legs. And I know you're going to be asking yourself, what is a bird doing defecating on its legs? When its bums are obviously far enough away, it doesn't need to do that. Um, the easy answer is that this bird cools itself down that way. It pumps a lot of blood into the skin uh, surrounding the leg bones. And then by defecating on the legs and letting the wind blow on those skinny legs, it cools the blood down considerably. And... Uh, and that way returns to the body cooler than it was, giving this bird the ability to stay cool when everything else around it is hot, albeit using its own dung. Well, quite nice to see that, that one of the smallest stalks in this particular area, in actual fact I think it is the smallest stalk, and much like all stalks, they actually don't have a voice box. So unlike a parrot or a sunbird or a canary or a budgerigar, which has voices that they use all the time, storks do not. And this particular stork is no exception. It doesn't have any voice box. What it does do is to attract mates. They do the most unbelievable dances and elaborate wing flaps and bows to each other. And there's a courtship amongst storks, which is quite phenomenal. Another thing that is quite phenomenal is the lilac-breasted roller. This bird definitely has some voice box, but in addition to the voice box, it also has superb coloration. You can see they're just sticking out of the, out of the branches, watching us with a beady eye. Is that lilac-breasted roller and flown away and probably returning to the same or close enough to the same branch just hawk or try to hawk an insect this time of the year their colors are not so bright and they don't have the tail streamers but they're giving us a beautiful afternoon shot they take your screenshots that is a lovely shot of a lilac breasted roller at this time of the year david framing it up so nicely. Remember that we are interactive. You can ask me questions while we are on Game Drive live and I'll try and answer as many as what we can. These are hole nesting birds. They rely on barbets and woodpeckers to create nests for them that they quite actively defend and will quite often in pairs defend against other rollers, other lilac breasted rollers and other birds as well which would like to make use of their, of their nests. That blue and purple color is really remarkable. Now we are almost at these lions. I can see one lion from where we're lying now. He's now